friends welcome to top education before going to sums we have to know this thing if we don't know this thing then we are unable to solve the questions also so first see here so when call is made to convert partly paid up preferences into fully preferences see in the question they have been given there is partly paid up preferences so there this entry will come preference share final call account to debtor to preference share capital account okay so this is the final call we are calling them yes pay this money this time next entry is when amount is received on call so we have uh, sent a notice to them please pay the remaining amount of the preference shares so they have paid this is the they have received so bank account debtor to preference shares capital account then we have when amount is due from redemption so when the amount is due from the redemption we have to give to the uh, the preference share holders okay we have not yet given we have just take down the amount and kept aside so that is known as redeemable preference shares capital account debtor premium on redemption account debtor to preference share holders account okay so here see with face value with premium to be paid on redemption total amount to be paid on redemption so this two totals will be added here okay next is when equity shares are issued to collect the amount of redemption and for premium okay so here the equity shares are issued to collect the amount of redemption so bank account debtor to bank account debtor discount on issue of shares debtor to equity share capital account to securities securities premium account see if the shares are issued at discount the entry will come here if the shares are issued at premium the entry will come here so here what we are doing we are issuing the shares to pay the redemption fund okay so fourth entry is done now let's move quickly to the fifth entry to adjusted rede redemption premium so this entry in every sum it comes so first is security premium account debtor profit and loss debtor general reserve debtor to premium on redemption account here they will be giving some in the questions only so it is very easy when amount transferred to crr see what is crr capital redemption reserve so profit and loss account debtor general reserve account debtor to capital rede uh, capital redemption reserve account if in the question they have maintained uh sub, keep a separate capital redemption reserve then you have to pass down this entry when asset is sold or taken the bank loan for redemption see we don't have money to give the amount to the preference share holders so here what we are doing taking loan or we are taking some assets se uh, selling some assets so bank account debtor profit and loss account debtor see lease on uh, sale on current assets those to current assets to bank loan account okay then when payment to preference shareholders actually this is the last entry where the payment is done preference shareholders account debtor to bank account next we have an issue of new shares for the payment of preference share so now new shares of preference shares we have done so here we can write preference share capital account debtor to new share capital account next we have when the decision is taken to issue bonus share this bonus share also has been issued this three entries or this four entries will come by the chance okay it will not come to you regular wise okay in few questions only we have this four entries so will, for the safer side we can learn this so capital redemption reserve account debtor securities premium account debtor any other reserve like specified in mentioned in the question those to bonus to equity shareholder account so we are giving the bonus to the equity shares when issue of bonus share is made bonus to equity shareholders account debtor to equity share capital here they have made the arrangement here they have paid here due here issued next what we have is when partly paid up shares are made fully paid up shares by bonus issue see in the first entry we saw it was a com uh, normal thing but here it is capital redemption reserve account debtor 
Securities premium account or any other reserve specified mentioned in the question to bonus equity share account when issue of bonus share is made. Bonus share, same entry. The, here we are adding just the final call. So guys, in the next sum, we'll be starting with the sums. Be with us. Subscribe to the channel Top Education. Thank you for watching this video. If you like, then please subscribe our channel Top Education.